my students welcome back to our evs class i hope you all are doing good please take care of yourself stay home stay safe so let us start our class in the last class we learned about photosynthesis what is photosynthesis the process by which green plants make their food using water and carbon dioxide in the presence of sunlight and chlorophyll is called a photosynthesis and where plants make their food plants make their food in their leaves so leaves are called food factories of the plant and what do plants need to make their food plants need carbon dioxide water sunlight and chlorophyll to make their food in this class we will learn how do leaves obtain sunlight water and air let us see one by one first is sunlight how do leaves get sunlight as we know that leaves are flat so they can absorb sunlight that falls on them and some plants the leaves are arranged on the stem of a plant in such a way that they obtain enough sunlight to make food okay the leaves are arranged on a stem on of a plant in such a way that they absorb enough sunlight to make food now second one is water we studied that roots absorb water from the soil roots absorb water from the soil and roots have narrow tubes and these tubes form a continuous network in the whole plant so the water travels through these tubes and reaches in every leaves and other parts of the plant if you look closely at a leaf you will see fine lines like structure on an entire leaf these narrow tubes are called veins these narrow tubes are called veins leaf mein ye ye jo lines hoti hain tubes hote hain kya bolte hain veins and there is a thick main vein in center called midrib aur jo center mein thick vein hota hai usko kya bolte hain midrib or main vein okay let us see in a leaf see this is a leaf okay and there are many narrow tubes these are called veins these are called veins see there are many tubes these are called veins and there is a thick main vein in the center called midrib ye jo center wala vein hota hai isse hum kya bolte hain main vein or midrib okay it passes through the center of the leaf ye kahan se pass hota hai center of the leaf okay and veins transport food and water to the plant and also support the leaf okay so how do leaves get water roots absorb water from the soil now next is carbon dioxide how do leaves get carbon dioxide there are tiny holes on the surface of leaves called stomata okay there are tiny holes on the surface of leaf called stomata and air enters through this stomata okay let us see in a leaf see there are many tiny holes in a leaf leaf mein kya hota hai bahut sare tiny holes hote hain okay so air enters through this stomata air kya karti hai is stomata se enter karti hai okay air enters through this stomata and the leaves absorb carbon dioxide gas present in the air to make food and gives out a 
oxygen and excess water through these stomata. Okay. Sometimes plants do not get sufficient water and sunlight. So they cannot make their food. For such times plants store food in their roots, stem, leaves, flower and fruits. We eat different parts of the different plant. Let us see what they are. First one is the food items which we get from roots of the plant like carrot and radish etc. Okay. Second one is the food item which we get stem of the plant like ginger and sugar cane etc. Now third one is the food items which we get from leaves of the plant like cabbage and spinach. Okay. Now next is the food items which we get from flowers of the plant like cauliflower, broccoli. Okay. Now next is the food items which we get from fruits of the plant. There are many fruits which we get from fruits of the plant like mango, orange, apple etc. Okay. Now last is the food items which we get from seeds of the plant like rice, wheat, pulses and other grains also. I hope you all have seen these fruits. Okay. Fruit, seeds, stem fruits. Okay. Now let us revise once again. First is how do leaves get sunlight? The leaves are arranged on the stem of a leaf. In such a way that they obtain enough sunlight to make food. Okay. Now next is water. How do leaves get water? Roots absorb water from the soil. Now third one is carbon dioxide. How leaves get carbon dioxide? There are tiny holes on surface of leaves called stomata and air enters a leaf through these stomata. Okay. I hope you understood this topic. That's all for today's class. Thank you.